welcome back to the channel and as you can know from last couple of days there are lots of things going on the quick lab and because of that you guys have lots of questions so in this video i'm going to give full overview of the quick lab arcade and arcade facilitator game and i will try to answer each of your queries and try to clear all your doubts so please watch the video till end i will make sure that you won't have any doubt after this so let's begin the video now we will discuss about the what different types of events that quicklab have okay so first of all just come over here and let's see so right now quicklab have three events called arcade games monthly trivia and arcade facilitator program which is going to start from the 17th of april 2023 okay now just come on the and see the what is the arcade games so arcade is a gamification platform where we have to complete some amount of labs and after completing those lab we will get a badge and that badge we can count as a point and after collecting multiple points we can use to redeem a swag let me just give you the one short example for you if i just go back to your here and this is a website of the arcade and if you just simply scroll down here you can see these are the games which are right now live for now the level one game is live how to join this game just simply open this thing in new tab then copy the access code like this and paste over here like this and paste the, and just simply click on join and then you are the part of this game make sure you have to do all these labs after 17th of april okay now just come back over here and let's see what is the arcade facilitator program arcade facilitator program is a sub program of arcade event where we have one facilitator i will tell you the role of the facilitator in later what we have to do we have to just complete multiple quests after completing some amount of quest we will get a skill badge and after having a three skill badge it will count as a point i will discuss in brief in later in this video so for now just remember this thing okay Now let's discuss in detail about the all the games. Before that, let me introduce our facilitator. So Harshwinder Gupta is our facilitator and he is a professional cloud architect certified. And if you perform the arcade games regularly, you will heard his name because he is the most of the time top three rank holder in the arcade games. Okay, one more thing guys, it's not only regarding about the Harsh, it's regarding about the all the facilitator who are the part of this event make sure that you use the proper word with them do not try to misbehave with them they are here to help you guys okay they share the all the details which they got from the higher authorities so just respect them and make sure you do not personally dm them they have already dedicated group whatsapp group or you can say telegram group you can just ping your queries over there and ask them do not personally dm them and try to misbehave with them so that's it for them now let's continue with the our video now i will discuss about all the possibilities of the quick lab event in detail so please watch the video carefully from here okay now let's take a scenario like you are the new player okay now let's first of all let's talk about the arcade games now you are doing the arcade games and you are the new player means you just heard about two to three days ago so first of all what you have to do you have to create a new account how can you just simply go to cloud skill boost open this thing new tab and just uh, log in with your google id once you're done with that first thing what you have to do as you are the new just go back to arcade okay here what you have to do just simply copy your email id copy this email id go back to arcade and just paste the email id over here like this and just simply click on subscribe make sure you have to do these things otherwise you will face unnecessary issue future so just make sure of that thing make sure one thing also do not use multiple accounts otherwise if they found you will be disqualified from the game so just make sure of this couple of things guys once you're done with that i will share the one form in the description box let me just show you the form so form must look like this okay so just fill out your details all the details let me just show you how to fill that so first of all just copy this paste over here then your name like i'm just doing quick lab then give us a email id now here we have to just use the public profile here how can you just go just go back over here click on profile just wait for a second and you can see make a 
pro public profile just simply click on make a public profile profile and here this is your public profile just copy this thing carefully because this is a very important link of your event so just copy that paste over here like this and if you have any queries just paste over here just simply click on next uh, submit so let me just turn this on click on submit and that's the way just verify yourself and just simply click on verify and it's done and you submit your form okay now you will get a credit after 17 or you can say on the 17th of april okay now what you have to do in arcade games if you are the new player what you have to do you have to just simply complete the games no need to complete the trip what are the games if you just go back to the arcade page you can see this is called the game this is a game and where you see the trivia okay for this month you don't have to complete this trivia i will tell this reason after that but in next month you if you want you can just complete the trivia also but for this month if you are the new player you don't have to complete the trivia you just need to complete the games okay now if you are the experienced player means who is doing the games from the january february or before that so you if you want you can use your old account any account it's having the credit or if you have the subscription you can use the both to complete the games and trivia also i hope this two part is clear for you now let's discuss about the arcade facilitator program because i know most of you guys have the query over here so first thing start doing live from the 17th of april and make sure you have to complete on 31st of may this is for the arcade facilitator thing okay now second thing you have to only use the credit which shared by the facilitator and i already explained you how to fill the form so what you have to do now here we have the three scenario for example you are the new player okay so you are the new player what you have to do just simply fill the form as i already told you how to fill the form okay once you're done in on 17th of april you will get a credit from the facilitator okay now once you get a credit just go back to the arcade page and here you will get a list of the quest you have to complete you just need to complete those quests after completing those quests you will get a badge let me just tell you one more thing guys after completing three quests or you can say three skill badges you will get a one point so just make sure of that thing and according to me i think they will going to quest in proper manner for example here you can see let me just give the one example just open these three things and okay now first of all what you have to do just click on this enroll in this quest complete all the labs once you complete all the labs you will get a badge over here let me just show you where you can see the badge if you just simply click on profile and in the, go to badges for now as we have the new account we don't have any badges after completing these three quests you will get three skill badge and that meaning of that you have one point okay so just make sure that you have to complete in that manner do not do not say like for example uh, if i just complete this quest then i complete this and i will complete this so meaning of that i have the three skill badge that means i have the point for now i think they will give the proper indentation for us like in what way we have to complete skill badges and that way we have to complete the skill badges and after that we will get the point according to that now for example so this is for the new player now let's talk about the experienced player here the experienced player is considered as who done the gccf 2022 or is done doing the last from 2018-19-20 okay so those players are in the experience category for those what you have to do you have to again create the new account as i done fill that form and complete your quest now here one catch if you want you can use your new account to complete the games also is your choice guys if you want to do that you can use that or you can use your old account to complete the games okay that's depend upon you okay now let's talk about the semi experience according to me those who start doing their labs from 1st of january 2023 till date those are in the semi experience category now you guys have two options first of all 
check your profile okay, just go back over here check your profile if you have please listen me carefully if you have one or two skill badges okay one or two skill badges and your monthly subscription is going to end in next 10 to 15 days okay then only just fill the form with your current account and just complete the lab after your monthly subscription ends i hope you got my point if you have one or two skill badges in your profile okay let me just tell you this call the skill badges okay and this call as a arcade points okay so just make sure of that thing don't get confused okay so if you have this kind of badges into your account like one to two and your monthly subscription is going to end in next 10 to 15 days you can use your current email id or you can say current account just fill the form and complete your quest once your monthly subscription ends because you have to use the credit which given by the facilitator i hope you got my point now there are some peoples who have the query like i i have a uh, couple of badges and my monthly subscription is going to end in next uh, 30 days or some have the two month subscription so for you guys just simply create a new account fill the form and complete your request i hope i am clear over here now let's talk about because some of you guys have the some queries like uh, if you just go to arcade page some of you guys already complete this thing some of you guys already complete this thing also like this request this request will they going to consider no because this is the information from the higher authority they are going to consider the skilled badge if you complete them after 17th of april till 31st of may this duration if you complete any skill badge or get a skill badge then it's going to be considered if you complete on the 16th if you complete on the 14th it would not going to be considered i hope i am clear over here if you still have any doubts please let me in the comment section okay now let's come back over here now let's take a summary of all this thing what is the arcade facilitator it is a sub program of arcade event what are the eligibility for it if you have the laptop and it's having the chrome browser you can just participate just make sure of one thing if you just go to arcade page scroll down to last and for here you can see what about the sending the price so if you are from the pakistan bangladesh iraq iran north korea from all this country they are not going to send the price over there you can participate but they are not going to send the prizes over there okay so just make sure of that thing also now if you just check the last point over here so it's mentioned like can i share or gift my arcade point to someone else so if you just click over here no you cannot share your arcade point to someone else or not your second account so just make sure of that thing both the accounts are different you cannot merge the both arcade points with them so just make sure of that thing also guys okay now what is the program timeline so it's from 17th of april to 31st of may 2023 what are the benefits so you will get a real-time experience on the google cloud services and that will help you to understand how the things will working on the real-time environment okay how to apply i will share the link in description box of the form just fill that form and you are done now if you have any kind of query and if you want to talk with the harsh regarding the arcade facilitator i will share the telegram link in description box so basically what you have to do just go to the telegram channel click on the about and from here just join this discussion group once you click over here and you can talk with the harsh anytime okay that's the thing and if you have any doubts regarding this please let me know in the comment section guys thanks for watching and have a good day